All right, we wanted to go out and do a little uh, metal tech today, didn't we, buddy? We did. But the fields still got beans in them, so we said, let's go ahead and get home and take care of some maintenance. Stay tuned. We're going to show you a couple things we get ready to do. All right, as y'all know, I'm not very good at uh, keeping my stuff clean when I'm going along. And uh, this company, Super Clean, right here, sent me all this right here. To help clean my boat and a lot of this stuff has got the normal cleaning stuff in it but there's one in here i think it's this one's got a oxalic acid in it which i think will help a lot to clean some of this stain off the side of the boat check it out we're gonna be working on that look at this this is ridiculous and we, we never clean do we but <laughs> hey we're too busy finding relics we don't have time do we don't have, buddy? Time. Don't have time i got one more thing i'm gonna show you real quick we're gonna be doing today we find all kind of lead. Here's some of my lead I've already melted down. And we up here I got my, my lead pot going here. We're getting ready to melt down a bunch of sinkers. We find sinkers, all kind of stuff made of lead in there. I got one big old piece of lead there I'm gonna probably melt down. Uh, but anyway, here's got a chunk of lead there. Big old chunk of lead. We're gonna melt all this lead down and we're gonna make diving weights like this right here. I'm gonna show you that process in a little bit. My friend John lent me these. Mine broke on me the other day. So, hopefully these will make it through it. So, all right, we got a lot going on here. Stay tuned. I'll show you some results in a little bit. All right, y'all might wonder why I'm taking so much effort and time to do this. Well, I got a secret I'm going to tell you. We're getting ready to upgrade. The old Relic Recovery boat will be going away, hopefully. And we've already been uh, scouting around on a newer boat because... When we get all our stuff in this boat, it just will not get up on plane and, and get to our spots fast enough. Right, buddy? Yes, sir. For me and buddy, and to get all our snooper rig in it, it just, it just loses its ability to get up on plane. And it goes so slow, it takes us way too long to get to where we want to go. So we got to spend more time relic recovery and less time riding. Right, buddy? Yeah, man, I found a nickel. Uh-oh, buddy's, buddy's finding relics already right in the boat. You might find a couple of Civil War bullets, a couple of Indian heads. No telling what we might find in the boat. I, I find stuff in there all the time. <laughs> Drop out. But anyway, we're going to get started right now getting this cleaned up. we got our lid heating up over here, so we'll show you that in a minute, too. Well, have a good time today, buddy. What do you think? Hey, yeah, man. <laughs> Beautiful day out here today, too. All right, stay tuned. I'm going to go check on the lid right now. I will actually heat up the uh, molds a little bit before we pour the hot uh, lid into them. You can see our stuff is already starting to melt down, turn into a liquid right here. So it won't be long now. Stay tuned. We just did our first pour of lead it came out pretty good i gotta clean that one up just a little bit but not looking bad i've never used one of these big ones before uh just loaded up with all new old fishing weights and colonial lead all kind of stuff in there we'll do another pour in just a little bit stay tuned i'll show you the next pour buddy looking good ain't it it's getting, it's getting better this is where a lot of my at times i put my anchors and all here it actually rusted onto the um deck here so that's a little hard to get out the rest of us coming pretty clean even the sides coming pretty clean but that's gonna be a problem right in there so might do some real scrubbing on that right here so we're getting there stay tuned do not try this at home this is very hot right, we're gonna go ahead and pour a couple more here are you ready buddy i'm ready all right let's pull one in here first uh oh got a little clean up on that one Clean up on aisle five. That one's going to have to pour a little bit out of the side. That one too. Let me grab my hand up a little above that metal there. This right here is a big one here. We're going to actually pour a pretty decent size one here. What do you think, buddy? Yep. Is that good? Yep. Let's see what that one does. All right. Got some more done. Stay tuned. All 
right, we're not quite finished yet, but check it out. It's looking good right now. We'll show you some before and after here at the end here, but there's still some rust stains. I'm having a hard time getting out. I actually used another chemical to try to get them out. And they're not coming out too easy. Everything else is coming really clean. All right, 18, we're almost there. All right, maybe one more pour on the lid and we'll be done. Check it out though. Got some nice dabbing weights done. I've never tried these dabbing weights. I guess these might be a good one to use for me and Buddy down there maybe. We'll have to check those out. Uh, these things are working, working good. I did have a pot failure. The handle broke off my pot while I had a pot full. That wasn't cool. But anyway, got everything cleaned up and we got just a little bit more to go with that and a little, couple more uh, old old weights will go melt down and make them look nice and pretty. Pretty cool. All right, almost done. All right, not a bad little afternoon. Got all those melting in. Nice dab weights. I'll have me a problem for dab weights next summer. All right, check this out. This is the slag that came out of the, um, as a molted uh, lid comes out, I scoop it out. And this is all the trash. That was not lid. I thought it was. It's not. Because it didn't melt. A lot of the sinkers have these things in it here. And that was all that kind of stuff in it. But trash. I'm going to throw that away right now. And we'll get over here and finish the boat up right now. Buddy, you did a great job, man. Buddy, buddy cleaned about 90% of it. I was doing a lot of the uh, melting of it. But I tell you what. It looks like a different boat, buddy. Yes, it does. Look at that. It looks like a different boat. That Let's is sell it clean. Now. Woo! She's going on the auction block now. I appreciate uh, y'all from Super Clean for sending me all my cleaning products. That worked out really good, too. Got the motor nice and cleaned up. Even cleaned all the grease out. Had drips down. I've got all that cleaned off. Looking good. Everything re-greased. I just re-greased everything with my grease gun. So everything's ready to go. Whew. I love it. All right. Well, that's the it for today. A little maintenance day. Melt a little lead, just enjoying life. It's nothing bad. All right, appreciate everybody coming along. Don't forget to click like, comment below, share. Buddy? Subscribe to the gig, man. <laughs> He's not paying attention, is he? <laughs> All right. Appreciate everybody coming along. See you on the next adventure.